Volunteer from Fairhope is back home after spending several days near Ukraine offering help to families fleeing the country. He wasn't alone. As WKRG News 5's Blake Brown explains, that man is part of a group assisting refugees, seeing things we don't want to imagine. It's a trip Fairhope resident Ari Morgenstern won't soon forget. I met a young woman, 21. She came with nothing but a baby in one arm and a bag in the other. So what I saw is heartbreak and tragedy and people who left everything and are now endeavoring to find a way to build a new life. He serves with the national organization Christians United for Israel, a group of volunteers who spent time near Ukraine earlier this month on a mission to help those fleeing the country, arriving back in the States last week. The Ukrainian people are among, if not the strongest people I've ever met. These are images captured on that trip of the mothers, children, and families who left everything in Ukraine when the war with Russia broke out. One young woman, she described to me a beautiful life, I think were exact words. Family, friends, a good job, and all of this was stolen from her in a moment uh, when the barbarians from Moscow decided uh, to invade her country. He says he witnessed incredible pain and suffering from those fleeing Ukraine who still have a tremendous journey ahead. A lot of these individuals, they're very strong, but it's impossible not to cry. It's impossible not to uh, mourn the loss either of your own loved ones or of the life that you were forced to leave behind. Ari says if he's called upon again to offer help, he'll travel instantly. Right now, he's not sure if or when that call will come. In Fairhope, I'm Blake Brown, WKRG News 5.